off the northern coast of Canada, crews prepare for what will be four of the heaviest pieces of equipment ever transported over the roads of British Columbia. Four of France's hydroelectric turbine runners, each weighing 168 metric tons, nearly 8 meters in diameter and 5 meters tall, needed to reach their destination at the Site C powerhouse, located on the Peace River in Fort St. John, Canada. The first leg of the trip was comprised of a 9,600 nautical mile ocean voyage. This was no small feat. To move the components from sea to land and ensure a safe arrival required more than two years of coordination. An anchor point north of Prince Rupert's container terminal was chosen because of its proximity. Considering the size and weight of these turbine runners, weather and tidal swings were of the utmost concern. Voith and our partner carriers had meticulously planned each and every detail of the transfer. The discharge was handled by the ocean-going vessel's crane, where the runners were relocated and sea fastened on the barge. The barge then made its way up the inlet to the turbine runner's offload location, where they were transferred to hydraulic trailers. Once the transfer was complete, the turbine runners were staged for the land portion of their journey. The final leg is a 1,175-kilometer road trip, with each turbine traveling on an 81.4-meter-long, 24-axle trailer. The entire sea to land transfer unfolded over three days. The turbine runners would now have to wait until the snow-packed roads are once again safe, and they can continue their journey on the path to clean, renewable hydroelectric power.